a special occasion, very special. For 50 years, they shared a love story. Not just a love for each other, but for a place that was part of their home. To anyone else, it was the beach, perfect for a summer's day. But to David and Becky Rosen, it was like their front yard, perfect for a lifetime. Until now. Boardwalk. Once it was for lovers, now just the survivors. This is our home. I'm not afraid. I'm worried about your safety. Forget about worrying. What's the worry? We have everything. We have each other. What happened to this neighborhood? It used to be clean and safe. Things change. Close your eyes. Ruth Gordon. Mesmerizing, moving, beautiful. In the most extraordinary portrayal of a most extraordinary career. Lee Strasberg, astounding, in a performance that becomes a major event of remarkable dimension. America has been good to me. But now, I'm afraid. And Janet Lee as Florence, unforgettable, in a role unlike any other she has ever played. Yeah, Ma, we live together. So don't call her that girl. Fine. OK. Live your own life, then. I wash my hands of you. So baby, how is this go to confession? Spending my day on the You're on my boardwalk, old man. I warned you about that. I left one country. I'm not about to leave another. Here is where I chose to live, and nobody's going to make me leave. A motion picture experience that is truly an occasion. Boardwalk, like love itself. Sometimes you can't just walk away. It's on! What? The fight! They're coming from every which way they can. Any which way they can. Because they're on to a sure thing. Clinton, Clyde are back in any which way you can. Breaker, breaker, one nine. There's your good news channel. It's on. The fight is on. Faster, funnier, and feistier than ever. Hey, Meno, it's that right turn, Clyde. He's big. Yeah, he's sizable. He said he beat everybody in the Marine Corps. I ain't a Marine. Clint is one tough dude who won't be trifled with most of the time. There's one too many women in your life. I think I love you. And neither will Clyde. Come back here with my Oreos, yes. Well, now they're up against it one more time. Oh, you're gonna pay for this. You're gonna pay. They're bashing barroom bully boys. Clyde, scrap the caddy. Get down! They're mauling malicious mobsters. And they're battling bizarre bikers. All right, then, let's start doing some stomping of our own. And most of all, facing down the meanest mangler. The, the fight is on. The brawniest brawler of them all. The fight is on. One Jack Wilson. It's the most knuckle-busting, gut-wrenching, brain-scrambling, butt-bruising, lip-splitting brawl of all time. It's a fight to remember. Clint Eastwood turned you every which way but loose before. Now you can bet he'll do it again. See him and the whole gang. Any which way you can. It's a sure thing. Any which way you can. Did you get this beautiful hair? Kmart. <laughs> 
so funny. I never go to the bathroom here if I can help it. Well, what do you do? Just hold it in. Stay away from liquids. Everyone knows that going to school is an education in itself. He wanted the dust. The gun's not the worst. It's the boogers that freak me out. One false move might wipe you out. <laughs> and any meal could be your last. I should know. My name is Clifford Peach. <laughs> and this is my story. You die every day for now, you got it. I'm not gonna pay. You got nerve, even if you ain't gonna live long. That was me before. Eat this. <laughs> Just some kids from school who want to kill me. Hey, Shelly, want to go to the movies tonight? Sure. Yeah, you have a real good time while you're there, huh? Bye. And this is me now. What made the difference? It wasn't my grandmother. Kick him in the cojones. That's it wasn't my father. I could call the principal again. It wasn't my enemies. You give me trouble. People don't do that around here. It was my bodyguard. You're dead. My bodyguard. A crazy idea. I'd like you to meet my bodyguard. Anything you want to say to me, talk to him first. That led to a great friendship. This is a story of hallway horror, mayhem after math class, and the most important lesson you can learn out of school. You know those things that stunt your growth. That strength has nothing to do with size, and everything to do with courage. One of them was short, one of them was strange. Together, they were absolutely unbeatable. My Bodyguard. understand why she has to come and live with us. She's got... Gary Coleman is Jimmy the Kid. Maurice, get thicker glasses. Right. Jimmy the Kid! And these kidnappers are planning the child heist of the year. Ha! <laughs> They're diabolically clever, masterminds of disguise. You know, when this is all over, we ought to get a group picture. Incredibly well financed. Hi, can I take your order, please? Um, I'm going to have, uh, chopped beef steak with... Above and beyond the law. You're in a new parking zone, sir. Brilliant organizational planners. Well, first we're going to lower the back door of that truck. Oh, Who planned this thing? The Three Stooges? Downright me. Hey! You guys just broke the law, you know that? 
there's only one man that can stop them. <laughs> Calling me in was the smartest thing you could do. Jimmy the Kid. Action! I love a good chase. Adventure. You think I look better as a blonde? Oh, I love you as a brunette. This is a horrific movie. Would you believe hysterical? Jimmy the Kid. Brannigan has now made her first feature film, co-starring with Ruth Gordon in Muggsy's Girls. Twenty bucks, a little volunteer work, and our lips are sealed. Muggsy's Girls is a... Jan Cheney is a nice person. She has a nice husband, and a nice dog, and some nice neighbors. Shake it around. Burn it. Put on a big smile. Stick them up. Everything about Jan is nice, until one night. Jan isn't just Jan anymore. She's something else. Would you be so kind as to explain your behavior this evening? No one. Maxine Malone was in my body and you slept with her. Honey, I told her to leave. When she's Jan, she's very, very good. Get drunk, make a fool out of myself. I, I wouldn't do anything like this. But when she's bad, she's Maxie. Max. In the flesh, lover. Oh, what hard luck stories they all hand me. Where's my wife? I was possessed by Maxie Malone. Ah! Get thee behind me, Satan. I'm warning you, Maxie. I don't want to have to resort to force. Well, one of us has to. Orion Pictures presents... So, make the bed. Don't touch me. Glenn Close. Light the light. And Glenn Close. How's about doing it in the closet? Sure, no, cut it out. Mandy Patankin. I'm in complete control. <laughs> Bernard Hughes. Ah! Most women avoid married men. Valerie Curtin. I improve them. And Ruth Gordon. And that was a her with a capital H. In Maxi. Their mission is for science. Their only vice. We used to sit around at night watching old time movie shows. Is music. You didn't know. We didn't know. We didn't know. We didn't know. What did you think? What did we didn't think at all. Voyage. Of the Rock Aliens. Dusty! Their destination is the home of Dee Dee, the hottest ticket in town. Her boyfriend, Frankie, uh, the hottest temper in town, and his band, The Pack, who are always cooking. But things are about to get hotter. Yeah. All it took was just one look, and Dee Dee short-circuited his fuse box. Uh, some guys will do anything to press a girl. Now Dee Dee's got her chance. What's <coughs> your name? Why don't you sing with us? This guy's gonna be dog meat. But the pack want his head. We're starving. Sorry, guys. I guess I made a wrong turn. Let's dance. Voyage of the Rock Aliens. Dance. It's magical. Maniacal. Could, could you wait? It's too short. It's got tunes. See, you never took auto shop. No. And tune-ups. It's okay. It's full of surprises. Watch it. And the beat never stops. Theodora. Tom Nolan. Craig Sheffer. 
Ruth Gordon, and a special appearance by Jermaine Jackson. So keep your eyes and ears open. And who's that? Your town might be next. Voyage of the Rock Aliens. More movies, more choice, and plenty of cinemania. Donald Sutherland's the bumbling British agent doubling his fate for the KGB in The Trouble with Spies. Next.